We give it a name. <laughs> I can dig it. <laughs> can you dig it? The band Talis is headlining bands at Barnard at Barnard Park in Greece tomorrow night. How neat is that? Mm -hmm. And joining us now is Billy Sheehan. He is the bass player. Our executive producer, Mike DiGiorgio, calls him his favorite bass player of all time. Thank you, Mike. And I, I uh, looked at a clip and I can see why he said that. You don't get to be a DiGiorgio favorite, <laughs> okay? Just for like, you know, nice. being just doing whatevs, you know I'll what I'm saying? It. He loves okay. you. That's very um, good. Anyway, you're a Buffalo native, so, you know, Rochester is probably, like, probably one of your old stomping grounds yeah. then, right? We used to play here all the time back in the day, the Orange Monkey, Penny Arcade, yeah. uh, Elliot's Nest, yeah. Riverboat, all these places Yeah. Uh, back in the day. And uh, Rochester was one of our favorite places to go. So uh, when I made a switch in uh, with Talos in 1983, changed some personnel out, I was lucky to find uh, Mark Miller, Amazing drummer from Rochester, New York. Yeah. Phil Narrow, incredible singer, and we went on from there. So this is a little reunion of that line of Italis. I, I just want to tell you something, uh, and this is going to sound like a little off base. I hope I'm not. Off you know, base? Um, huh? I got I that. I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. <laughs> I knew what I was saying, okay? <laughs> I gotta tell ya, you, if you cut your hair and I put you in a business suit, you could be a main anchor here. Uh, does this guy not have a voice? I've got the voice. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 You know, his voice has bass. Come on. This guy's amazing. <laughs> anyway, uh, so you're here, you're performing, and, yeah. uh, you know, it must be great. You've got fans that you've, got, you know, you've had for, for decades, and then it's, new fans, too, right? It's amazing. We did a little autograph thing at the house of guitars and an acoustic oh, the set. the hog. Of course. Amazing. <laughs> yeah. Legendary. Legend, yeah. And so many people come out we hadn't seen for 20 years or more. <laughs> Unbelievable. So we were talking about that amongst ourselves uh, last night at dinner that, you know, when you play in a band and you play music and you perform, you you affect people's lives. Mm -hmm. And yeah, really, mm -hmm. we see that. And it's really, really touching to see yeah. How, yeah. Much we've, how, how we've connected with so many people over the years. And it seems like it's really come all full circle for you. You started in Buffalo. You went off. You played with some legends. You're a legend in your own right. And now here you are back with friends. Just talk about your career. There's so much well, to say. Well, thank you very much. I, well, I've been very lucky. I, I worked hard, but I had a couple of great lucky breaks. I had uh, hit records and mm -hmm. platinum records and all that. And it was very nice. Uh, you performed with the, the big names, though. Mm -hmm. I mean... Yeah, we did uh, the David Lee Roth uh, band. That was a uh, that was quite a quite an adventure. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Big, we had a, a number one single with that band, and uh, but coming back with my friends here, you know, it's it's just a what a joy it is. Yeah, yeah really fantastic. We played a clip when we were heading to break of you yeah. doing a, a little solo, and thing. I was telling Mike I'm that like, I've like, never <laughs> seen a bass player rip it like this. I'm used to you know just you know quarter notes or you know kind of driving the yeah. the beat with the drums but you take it to a whole other level how did you get to this point lots of practice i mean starting well, actually, out actually playing in clubs every single night we used to back in the day we used to do we did 21 nights in a row one time we did three complete shows in one day one time so all that time on deck on stage just just kind of lends itself mm -hmm. to uh uh, strength and agility and things like that and plus I just love music and I love playing and I I, I, I rarely put this thing down. I was gonna yeah. say bass is your thing right so do you have, you have like are there other instruments that you you know you, you're really into as well? I'll write on guitar I can mm -hmm. fake my way around drums and I, yeah. I even bought a saxophone. Hey oh. did you? Yeah so nice. was, we were having a party at my house and it's time for everyone to go I pull that out. <laughs> Wait, then he turns into Kenny G. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you, 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 this guy is so cool. And, and when I when I saw that video of you performing, I'm like, that guy's coming in here. Oh, that's very kind. Yeah, and Mike yeah. was all excited. Yeah. So I can't wait to meet the rest of the the gang. Who, who do we have with you today? We have uh, Mark Miller, yep. who is uh, one of the most spectacular drummers I've ever known. Okay. I've been lucky to play with great drummers all right. for my whole life. Yeah. And uh, and some some guys that are known all over the world. And That's awesome. Mark is easily one of the best drummers I've ever known. Okay. Great. Uh, singer Phil is um, uh, just incredible yeah. vocalist, and he's got a, amazing hair, as you have pointed oh. out. You were, is who, he the hair guy? He's the hair guy. No, Hi, I'm Phil. He's the hair. There's the hair dude. <laughs> Phil, how you doing? Phil is much more than his hair. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, he is not his hair. No. <laughs> yeah, he is not we'll, his hair. We'll meet them when we come back. We'll introduce you to them. And also, I wanted to point out how neat this guitar this was is because this, uh, you said this was custom made for you. It's a, it's my version. It's my model of uh, bass made by Yamaha, and uh, they make them, uh, uh, distribute them all over the world. We have a Facebook users group with your, Yamaha Attitude. Yeah, you got uh, your name on the end there. Yeah, too. You so know you've my, made it when, when you get your own bass guitar. guitar, right? Yeah, it's pretty this cool. This is so cool. And I love the color, by the way. Thank mm -hmm. you. Yeah. Sonic Blue. Yes. Sonic Blue? <laughs> and where's home, by the way, for you now? 
Uh, Los Angeles, California. Yeah, okay. LA. Yeah, the, the 32 years now I've been out wow. there. Wow. Yeah. Well, I'm, welcome this back. This guy's voice in this though. area. I'm sorry. <laughs> I can I'm listen. I'm so hung up on this voice. Like, you, you gotta, I don't know, I want you to like read You'll Goodnight Moon find. or something, you know? <laughs> you know? Come on. Okay. You, you want to take the, the, tag, the tease here and toss us a break? Uh, coming up, we're going to meet the rest of Talos next. Perfect! You said it.